Alright, hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun with Fu. and last time well, we went, went and saw, oh what's her name, uh, Lady Hammett. We went to Lord Hammett's castle, met Lady Hammett, and she told us that, well, Lord Hammett's been, <laughs> I almost said stolen away, kidnapped by Dodonpa and Donpa, no, and Loonpa. All these... Oh, O's and ahs and uh, just too much. And well, Ivan told her apparently she is Ivan's adoptive mother, and we learned that Ivan is actually a Jupiter ad adept baby, and that he was given to Lord Hammett along with the shaman's rod, and that this was all foretold in some great prophecy or something like that, and. We were instructed to follow our our destiny but instead of going to try and save Lord Hammett or anything and leave that to Lady Hammett. Which, you know, good honor, but... Yeah, whatever. Leona is putting up a strong front whenever people are around. It's so hard to see her like this. Anything else? Lady Leona was crying la again last night. I wish there was something I could do. Oh, poor Lady Hammett. Let's go search their rooms. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, there's no barrels. I don't even know why. Nothing. Might as well loot what we can while we're here. It's not a big place either, as far as I remember, so this should be easy. Oh, hey! Merchants are supposed to be protected under the laws of Angara. The Ranpa must be truly evil to break such a law. You gonna sell anything to me? What? Has the legacy of Lord Hammond's silk trading come to an end? I guess so. How can you say that Lady Leona would be devastated? <laughs> Ooh, there's a turban. It's a symbol of Kale's soldiers. Aha! Knew there was something. What do we get in the chest? Water jacket. Oh my god, that would be the best thing in the world right now. Can you imagine just wearing a jacket filled with water in this heat? Alright, who's got the lowest? I am going to give it to... Sorry, Ivan, but that agility drop is not worth it to give you just a few points of defense. You're going to stay with your elven jacket for now. And what's behind door number two? Oh, stairs? Another guy? The townsfolk don't know about Lord Hammond yet, do they? Nope. As far as I know. I don't know how they kept him in the dark for a few months. Apparently that's how long we've been gone, but still. Aha! Goodies! Got a nut. Lord Hammond will be released soon, right? I hope so. Otherwise, Leona will be overwhelmed by Starro. This is how you do female voices in voice acting. I am obviously an expert. You should all listen to me. <laughs> oh, God. I'm so bad at doing voices. Nothing. I'll reveal you are the most useful thing ever. What do you guys got to say? We'll take care of the kidnapping incident just fine. You should continue on our quest. Okay. I guess we will just continue on our quest. But you know... Okay, are we all listening? Let's stop right here. I love this music. Why are we stopping in a place like this? Yeah, we have to hurry or we'll be late for Colosso. Late for Colossal, we can't have that. That won't do it all. We paid good money to see Colossal, we can't be late. Everything will be just fine, folks. We're just checking to make sure no one is missing. Well, I guess that's okay. But if anyone is missing, we're the ones who will miss out. Forget about them, let's just get a move on. Yeah, jeez. Oh dear. Alright, hurry up and start counting. <gasps> oh, 
Looks like they're missing someone. Who could it be? <laughs> I just love how much time they're wasting. Uh-oh, we're sure at one person. No, now where could he be? Let's just recheck these lines over and over. What's going on? Why aren't we leaving for Tolby yet? Just have for patience, folks. We'll be on our way soon. There are a lot of people waiting to see Colosso here. <laughs> hey, what's up? Why are the guides passing back and forth? <laughs> Come on, why aren't we leaving yet? I hear there was a landslide on the road to Tolby. We paid good money to take this cruise to see Colosso. <laughs> We have to decide if we're entering Colosso once we reach Tolby. Right when we're leaving, they tell us we have to ride a boat. I can't stand boats. If I had known, I would never have come. God, I get seasick so easily. <laughs> it's just a shame a man like you can't ride on a boat, Uranos. What a hilarious coincidence. That's it, we can't wait any longer. Can't wait, what do you mean? <laughs> we all knew that anyone who was late would be left behind, right? Every under everyone understood that. Then what's the problem? We'll miss the boat if we wait any longer. <laughs> miss the boat, we can't let that happen. We paid a lot of money. We have to arrive before the carnival starts. There's nothing we can do. Let's go! Yeah, let's go. Voices that don't match with people. Okay, follow me and stay in line! And they're off. Finally. <laughs> oh me oh my, looks like I slept in, the lazy old bastard I am. Now I'm worried about my ground go 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 where did he go? Where'd he go? Oh my god, there they are. No, they wouldn't have left without me, would they? Oh, God, nobody cares about daughter and old man. <laughs> anyway, now that that's over, I think we can actually go to the inn now. Uh-oh, he's still here, even though his group has left. That wasn't nearly old womanly enough. Our inn feels so empty now that the Colossal Tour group has left. We can actually go down here. It should be like... Even our chef has left, so we can't keep our business open. Not that it matters, we still have a few customers until the Colosso ends. Do we have to read her mind? Even if my husband wanted to go on the Colosso tour, I would never let him. There's no telling what he'd do without me watching him. Oh my. Now that they're gone, I believe there's something we can find in one of the rooms. Oh, not this room. Sorry guys, didn't mean to just barge right in on ya. Isn't there? Isn't there? Oh, maybe it's in Tolby, because, I mean, obviously we're going to Tolby since it's been announced so much. I think it's in the hotel in Tolby when we find that they've left something behind there. So anyway, let's go continue on our quest, you know? You know what, first, though, I feel like going over here. No, I feel like uh, going north, you know. Oh my god, death caps. Just run away. They're. Oh, wait, we're not over the bridge yet. I was gonna say, they're just so weak. No, it's over. The... Once we pass this bridge, ha da! Now they're so weak. But you know what? I feel like going north and visiting our good old friends in uh, this town, which I totally didn't forget the name of Vault. You know, good old Vault. Vault, Vault, Vault. So many good memories, you know? Let's go visit our good friends in here. Wait, what? I hit somebody, so they put me in here. What I did was stupid, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Wait a minute, where'd the, where'd the thieves go? I need to learn to control my temper. Oh my god, have they already served their sentence? Oh, it's you. I was just talking about you with our mayor. You're all really strong, so I say, let those thieves attack. They won't be able to get past you. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What happened? What happened? Oh, Isaac, you've come back to Vault. Ever since you left, all sorts of crazy things have been happening. Like letting thieves go? 
Those thieves you caught have just escaped from jail. We were worried that they might come after you. Have you run into them? No, I haven't. Well, that's good, but be careful. There's no telling what they might do. Huh. As long as we stay alert, those thieves won't give us any more trouble. Well, I'm not sure about that. I mean, they are thieves. They are tricky bastards. Alright. Yeah, we gotta go around. Okay. But what I want to do here is... We have a little friend to pick up. Oh, hello, doggy. Ruff, ruff. I'm a dog. <laughs> if you bring me some bones, I'll tell you a secret. Oh. Well then. I guess if we stumble upon any bones, we'll give them to you. But for now, we want to ring this bell. And then that gin will pop out. <laughs> and once we go back down, you'll notice that circle of graves seems to have a peculiar pattern to them. Hmm. Oh, wrong one. Actually, wait a minute. Do we have bones? No. Anyway. Wait, what? Oh my god, there's a cave. Oh my god, we're walking around bones and dead people. Oh shoot, I forgot about that. <laughs> I forgot he was a mimic. Oh man. Alright, let's just pull out all the stops, you know? Some ice horns, some Ragnarok, some gusts and scorches. We got it, we got it. This guy's no problem. Oh no! Sleepy sheep! Sleepy sheep! Alright. And... Yeah, go for another Ragnarok, you know, why not? I'm trying to even think if we would get anything from this guy for beating him. I don't think so. I think it's just purely experience, but these guys are worth a buttload of experience, so why not? Yeah, look at that. 417 experience points. Oh, we got a vial. No big thing. So what's up here anyway? Why do we go through the why are we going through this cave at all? Well, it looks like it's a, its own little mini dungeon. Oh my god, there are bears right underneath the vault. <laughs> I think with all these monsters they'd they'd get attacked by more than just thieves. <laughs> yeah, go with the corona. They should be easy enough to beat, though. I mean, they're just fighter bees. And a Ravager. Yeah, look. We'll be able to take them out next turn. We just want to get some gin ready so we can take care of the next group of enemies very easily when we run into them. Yeah, look at that. Easy enough. Alright. Now, what is up here? What? Well, I wonder what we have to do here. Could it be that we just have to move this flame over? To put it on the flame... ...button? Nah, that would be too simple. Oh, well, there we go. Can't wait until the puzzles actually start getting difficult. Oh, wait a minute. Before we go on... Isn't there something behind here that we get to go? A room of some sort? Yes! Haha! -ha. I don't. Aha! Yes, I was right. It wasn't. It was not a. Mimic. Alright, now this is a Vambrace. It is cursed. <laughs> so. Hmm. Question is who to equip it on because once we equip it, we can't unequip it until we go to see a priest of some sort. I am going to just equip it on Garrett and. Oh no, it's not cursed! I thought it was. Oh. 
Thought we'd finally run into our first cursed item. Jeez. Come on, game. I wanna I wanna have some fun here. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Didn't uh. Yeah. Chain shortcut to frost. Right. There we go. Because we need to freeze all these, and I don't want to just be going back into the menu each time to freeze another one. <laughs> there we go. Another glimmering pillar of frozen liquid. And, okay, only two more. I don't see why they add the extra one, because, I mean, it's not really much of a puzzle. First time you just freeze everything and see which ones you can jump to. It's not like you can have a limit to the amount of frozen pillars that you can have on screen at once. So... Uh... Yeah, let's go this way first. Uh, no. Actually, no, let's not go that way first. Uh, I'm trying to remember which way we have to go. Because one way will have us backtrack, because we didn't do something yet, and the other way will just have us backtrack, because we do do the thing that we have to do. Oh, damn. For such a tasty pastry, that did a lot of damage. Let's get a cure well on him. Some fireballs. Some plasmas. And some ice horns. Yeah, that'll do. Cool. Perfect. Take that, you damn bear. Alright, what's down here? What's down another door? Okay, yes, I was right. We do have to go the other way first. Damn. Alright, let us use a holy or sacred feather. It acts, it acts kind of like a repel, I think I've explained that, but instead of just completely blocking any attacks from lower level monsters, it just decreases the chance that they'll attack. There we go. Flip the switch, drain the water. Perfect. And before we go back, we will just check what this room is. Check what this room is. Aha! So this is that puzzle. So this is kind of a cool puzzle because... You basically have to time when you push the torch pedestal. Because <laughs> otherwise... It will go out, you'll have to leave the room, and redo it all. I remember this being a, a bitch to finish sometimes. Right, one more. Maybe this way. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Move you down so you're not in the way of anything. There we go. Go, 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 go! Hurry, hurry, hurry! It's just a pain to go. have to go back and do everything again. Alright, ready? Go! 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 You can do it! Oh my god, we just... we just missed that. Oh my god. There we go. And this is a handy little shortcut. Right back up here. Oh yeah, because I forgot that it flooded this area. Huh. How about that? Guess it all worked out after all. <laughs> Alrighty, and we should be good right about now. Funk soul, brother. Get up there, get up there, get up there! 
There you go. And... What do we have waiting for us? Why an Earth Gin? And unfortunately, I think we actually have to fight him. <laughs> after all that. But I'm probably wrong. Because you know how I am with these. Lambkin Desert? Yes, it's okay to overwrite that. And... Cool, we do just get him for free. Oh my god! Light all over me. <laughs> and we get Sap, who is actually a really good Jin because he deals damage and steals HP, just like his name. He saps the HP. However, I think what we want to do is... No, you're an illusionist now. We want... Information. Is it... No, what's the, um... Shoot. Oh well, I thought there was a combination we could do with Jin at this point, but I guess I'm wrong. Why did I do that? Oh well. We'll fix it up soon enough. Watch, I was actually dumb and... Gave the right combination to Ivan. Nope, nope, no I didn't. Shoot, what is that combination? No, shoot, this is why I, this is why I hate moving Jin because I always forget what which Jin I'm moving where, and I end up giving people the wrong Jin completely. All right, you can stay a gallant for now. I don't think you learn anything new, but. Eh, whatever. And I think in order to get out, we can just go and retreat. Maybe? Please? That'd be really helpful. Yes! There we go. Oh, wrong way. And basically circumvent having to go through the entire dungeon all over again. Ugh. Alright, so we gotta give a dog a bone. And then we're done with Vault. Forever. So anyway, you know, let's go visit our house. Totally going to Loompa, but let's go visit home first. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Golden Sun with Mioxfu as we go back to home. <laughs>